Hello everybody and welcome back to No Place Like Home, where today we're going to continue our explorations. Also, I'm hoping, yes, um, I was hoping that the fields would be ready because we picked up onion seeds last time. We did, we picked up onion seeds, but I didn't have any room to plant them, so I think that's why I felt like we needed to go to bed. Uh, also, the, the episode time was kind of over anyway. So, uh, with that, we can, just to remind you, we can make ratatouille once the onions are ready. We can indeed make ratatouille once the onions are ready. And uh, then we can finally make our cow pen. And then we can start on all of the, the cow stuff. All of the, the taming of the cows. Because I can do all of that. I've got all of the wood and things. I need to light the bonfires to get the hay out and uh, to tame the cows but I just don't have um I just don't have the actual cow pen to put them in so I figure I'm probably gonna need that before I tame them. So while we're waiting for the onions to grow I reckon we'll go and see Rudy and get the bulbinator and we'll uh, finish off the minecart stuff as well. So where are my onions? So you find the onions not surprisingly <laughs> to be honest near where the cows are so it's kind of making sure that you find them when you need them because you need them to make the cow pen because you need them for ratatouille and then you find onions around the exact place where you would start needing them for the cows so totally makes sense all right grow some beetroot as well and it for the beetroot i think it is and we'll do some corn not corn, it's uh, sorry, dirty, dirty wheat, I think it's called. No idea why it's dirty. Is it like radioactive or something? I don't know. There's lots of it though. Good grief. And that was it for that. Lovely. Um. Any other seeds? Got garlic, garlic bulbs. Okay, no, that's fine. That's absolutely fine. So we are getting to the point now where there's a little bit less uh, stuff to have to plant all the time. But not quite getting as there's more puzzles and less stuff in this new area which i think is a good thing to be honest it's actually quite easier to walk in a line i remember i was doing this last time wasn't i I'll just grab any little ones i miss at the end quite satisfying until you run out of inventory space but I'm hoping I won't run out of inventory space I'm hoping that that'll all be good there we go all done lovely right so let us go to the preservers and preserve the things that we need to preserve get this inventory sorted out basically so pumpkins it's getting to that time of year, isn't it? Definitely a pumpkin time of year now. Now, annoyingly, I'm going to want one of every type of vegetable. So maybe we'll keep some garlic, pumpkins, beetroot, lettuce, corn. We did strawberries already. Maybe we'll give one of each of those in. Okay, let's head out, head to the recyclers. Now I, I kind of uh, made the I took away a row of recyclers because they didn't look right. They seemed to have let me put these down and then patched it so that I couldn't make them as close together. 
So I, I like them how they are, nice and close together for now. I might not be able to repeat that next time I have a, a farm, but for now I can, so that's what I'm going to do. I don't know if I'm going to need glass for anything. Or... I have no idea, actually. I think I might just put the, the rubber and the glass and all that away in the chest. Just so I've got them if I need them, so... Ugh, the acorns shouldn't even be in there. I think I was putting acorns in there for a little while. Well, my turbo sprinklers, I'm never going to use them because I've already got everything sprinklered up. Well, unless I put another farm somewhere, but at the moment I'm doing okay for farming space, actually. Uh, all the veggies up here. We've got glass. We got rubber and glue. More glass. Glass doesn't stack very high, not like electronics. So I'm guessing you just don't get very much of it. Okay. How is my inventory looking now then? Not too bad. Oh, we've got components that need to go in as well. That's not too bad. Or oh, wheat there. I'm just trying to put all of the things I'm going to give in to the to the lady in one place. Okay, let's go over to the farm chests and put away the acorns. I wish you could preserve them, but I, I can understand why maybe you can't. <laughs> They're spare seeds. Keeping fields uh, in that second row there. And I've got wood, I've got snowballs. More acorns. So I might need one stack of acorns. I certainly don't need like three stacks of acorns. Let's do that. That's a good chest, right? Okay, lovely. So then we've also got this chest here. It's got some pepper seeds, orange, peach, peach, orange. Orange, peach, orange, peach. <laughs> So yeah, like that that's a lot better. I've just got a few peppers to grow and then we're back on track with the, the farming. That's good. I'm super happy with that. That will do. Okay, time to go. How have I still got fields on my hotbar? Gah! Seriously, this cleaning up malarkey takes takes me ages. I'm in there. Right, okay, cool. Everything is, is stored or recycled or doing what it's meant to be doing, which is great. I kind of feel like I want to go around the lonely hills grabbing nests. How many have I... That's probably something I should do more at the end, though, isn't it? Just, so just while we're waiting for the onions to grow, I'm gonna... Oh, this is not where I wanted to go. This is the underground. Oops. I'm gonna go through to uh, the uh, correct place. I'm gonna go up to the mine carts. Oh, no, actually. Scrap that. What am I doing? I need to go see Rudy, and Rudy is actually just up on the farm, so I may as well just go and see him up there. <sighs> I don't know. Okay, so, Rudy. I have 11,000 preserves now. <clears throat> okay, what brings you here? I want to know, um... Ah. 
Okay. Well, I was supposed to go and talk to Rudy, but maybe it's only like one particular instance of Rudy that will have that. Let's have a look. Talk to Rudy about the Bulbinator. Hmm. So I don't know whether I need to go through to the Lonely Hills or whether I can speak to him down in the village. Because he's moved from the Lonely Hills now. Let's see. Hope this hasn't broken it then. Or maybe I'll he may have popped back up in the in the Lonely Hills, or maybe his Lonely Hills self that's just at the beginning of the area might have it still. He's got several iterations of himself, so. Let's go, and, let's go and see House Rudy and see if House Rudy knows about the Bulbinator. Ellen, doing great, I hope. Here we are. Hey, Rudy, I was wondering if you still have that old Bulbinator lying around. You know me, I'm not going to let a good piece of tech lying around and go to waste. Can I borrow it? There's some gas that needs destroying. Oh, you helped me so much. Here goes. But you'll need to refuel it using lime algae. Check the shore. Some most likely got washed up recently. Bring me three and I'll give you the Bulbinator. Okay. So we're getting somewhere. The Bulbinator will help us, but we need to find some special algae. They get washed up on the shore in the village. Right, so by on the shore, do you mean by the... By the river, or do you mean like... Um... What do you mean, like, on the shore over the other side? I'm not seeing anything like that. Okay, I'm gonna go out to the, uh, the actual shoreline. Which is what I think he might mean by that. Like out the gate here. Let's see if there's anything along here. Cause the, this is also the shore, but uh, I I don't know which shore he kind of really means. Lime algae. Well, probably one of these things that I'll know when I see it. A box. Seeing this stuff. Seeing various bits of trash. I don't like the sand, it's coarse and rough and irritating and gets everywhere. Okay. Well, I mean, it says the shore, so... This is water I'm finding, honestly. Uh, I do not have a clue. definitely said the shore in the village and this area is the village I am being very dumb about this clearly like it's not obvious just read it again just in case I've missed something gifts of the sea Bulbinator will get will help us. We need to find some special algae. They got washed up on the shore in the village. And then, yeah, this is definitely the shoreline. Um, the only other thing to tr to try would be going the other way, where we found um 
Oh, Cornelius under the bridge around that sort of area because there's kind of beach down there. Let's, let's try it. I've certainly not seen it anywhere else. close to the shore can we get? Actually, we can get all the way down to the beach down here. And I've not been there before. Aha! Yes, this is where it is. <laughs> Special algae. Three of them. Awesome. There's a whole area out there and like in into the sea. I'm like that's gonna be interesting. I wonder what they're actually gonna do with that. I'm I'm super curious. Alright, Rudy, I found your algae. It took me way longer than it should have done, but I found it, okay. I'm glad they were quite specific about where it was. I never would have found it otherwise. But yeah, it kind of makes sense. So that's that's the shore. That's the beach. Okay, let's go find Rudy again and say hello. Give me the bulbinator. Gee, why could you never find the fuel yourself? I'm doing all this work. I cleaned literally this whole area and rebuilt your entire house. Well, you built it, but I gave you all the materials to rebuild your entire house. And I still have to go find all the stuff. See, is that Rudy's car? Also, like, why have I never gotten that one before? Alright. I have the algae to refuel the bulbinator. Bulbalator, even. Is it bulbalator or bulbinator? Great, I will refuel it immediately. Here it goes, tell me when it's done. I'm very concerned. Uh, okay, the toxic gas needs to be disposed of, but I can't just bring the bulbinator there myself. It's time for a little innovation. Perhaps there's a way to bring the bulb bulbinator there automatically. Lily might know something about it. Ask Lily if she knows a way to transport the refueled machine, and then uh, transport refueled bulbinator to bulbinator. It is a bulbinator, sorry, to the toxic mushroom area. Okay, great. So now I need to go back, probably back to the fast travel area would be the quickest. No, maybe not actually. I might actually, because I'm here already, I might actually be quicker just going through the gate. I never know, honestly. We have the recipe for ice cream now, but we do need cows to do it, and then I'll be able to run a bit faster, which would be amazing. We've already got one level of running faster. But I want the other two levels now. <laughs> right now. Okay. I did that re that apple pie recipe. That seems to be eluding me a little bit, but uh, I will try some. I'll try like maybe apples and flour or something. It got a bit, probably a bit of tidying up to do around it because uh, I haven't been in this way for a while. And although I've tidied it all up previously on ways through, I didn't have the glass uh, the glass drill at that point. I've got a few to do. But yeah, remind me. Remind me what I need for those tree covers. I replaced all the broken parts of the ball layer. What should I do now? Great. The only thing remaining are trees. There are dirt holes around the ball layer where you can place acorns to grow oaks. Cover them up with something. If you don't, the trees will grow in such a cold temp sorry, won't grow in such a cold temperature. Just so happens I can teach you how to make them, but you'd have to bring me some famous Ellen cooking. Okay. I have feathers for you. That's sweet, my dear. I took the samples from my study and added the feathers to your binder. Beautiful, aren't they? Okay. Um, thanks for the chat. Okay, so let's have a look. I need... Yeah, that is the apple pie. I make the water filth, but I don't need it yet. I will be able to make the ratatouille very soon. I can't make pancakes yet. And I do have the cheese fondue recipe, but I can't make it yet. 
Okay, so it's pancakes and apple pie, the only two recipes that I think I really need. Grab that suitcase. Okay, more firewood. That doesn't hurt, I suppose. Would have, would have been nice to get one of the two recipes I'm missing, but, you know, beggars can't be choosers and all. Whatever's in there is good. No complaining now. Right, so... I think... We shall head on. Oh, of course, this is the board end, isn't it? But they, I can plant the acorns, but they aren't going to grow until I can put the uh, covers onto them. Looking very nice, actually, isn't it? It'd be very cute for them. Okay, so next task, go... I've got to go all the way up here to ask her about stuff. See this robot? I'm going to talk to him again. Must plant tree wreck. Creepy, I should go. Where am I going to find these, uh, these robot parts? I think I got this feeling I'm being dumb and I've not found them when I should have found them. Everything's pretty clean around here though. I have a feeling I need to be down there. I don't know how to get there. Let's see if we can find it. I, I know I'm getting a little sidetracked. Let's see if I can... Oh, we've not been in this area at all. Okay. Sometimes you can go inside the houses as well, so... That was the thing we found out last time. meals so wheat seeds there's another cow down here three bonsai trees hmm. be used as decorations okay I love the cows, they jump, they're so cute. They are the new thing for this uh, this patch. We didn't have cows before, so. I wonder if I can just mosey on around there. No, apparently not. Okay. Go up here. Yes. Then I can't get any further. Right, okay. Uh. I make a box bridge. This is how. Okay, cool. I was wondering how I was getting across there, and now we know the answer. Potato salad. All right, I got some robot spare parts. Yes. Is that the first one? One robot spare part. Yeah. 
You have a feeling that crab robots look at you with envy. Okay, interesting. How many did I need? Three robotic spare parts. That's rather a lot, isn't it? But that was probably why that one was like shining. So, are there any other shiny, shiny suitcases? There's a shiny, shiny box there. Aha, I can go his idea. Doesn't look like it's particularly got anything uh, that interesting though. Ah, robot spare parts in there, I think. Yes. Okay, that's two out of three. And we'll go up and see, see my friend. Another box there. I'm gonna need to put the boxes like in a chest or something, like the spare ones, because I'm not using them nearly as much. Okay, so we found one in that house. Can I go in the house down here? I haven't actually tried. Yes. That might be where the third piece is. No, I'm not sure. There's a boar there. This one didn't glow until I'd uncovered it, so there's a good chance that it could be in one of these trash piles here. Nope. Yay! There you go. Robot spare parts. One across the water. You've got to use boxes to make a bridge. One in the house at the top and one in the house at the bottom. Wonderful, let's go fix the forester. Poor little dude. I couldn't have done that quest until I had the glass drill though, so. He's such a cool robot, he really is. It's like, it's like it's his little staff, his little totem pole staff. Okay. Must plant, tree wreck, here are the parts. All systems operational, engaging combat mode. Combat mode, you liar, I'll kick your butt. Excuse me, username, comedy module, initialized earlier than expected. I'm awaiting queries. My query is stop destroying trees. Manual control, unavailable. Remote override, activated. Please disable remote signal to access manual control. The menacingly looking radio station at the top of a hill seems to be the culprit as it broadcasts the nonsensical command towards the robot. I must shut it down as soon as possible. Is it a coincidence that such a signal was uploaded there in the first place? Turn off the signal corrupting the robot. Right, so there's a radio tower at the top of a hill. Where? I do not see a radio tower. Then maybe get to it via this tree. Ladder on this tree. Hang on, because you gotta go. Keep getting stuck in this stupid garden. Ah. Then it was at the top of a hill, so I'm just gonna go up here and see if I can see a bit better, at least. 
there's any way I can go from here. No. There really isn't. Okay, new day has started. Yay! But yeah, I'm not seeing no radio tower. So uh, that might be a bit further on. I'm not sure. So we're going to move on from the robot for now. Drink. Right, so we're going to move on from the robot for now. And we're going to go up to, well, I think, as much as I think I know what I have to do, apparently we do have to go and talk to the lady first. So I will do as it says. And I will go and talk to her. I have forgotten her name. Lilia or something, I think. Lil. Lily, something like that. But her quest is a pain. It's difficult to do. But yeah, so far I've been to all the areas except for the one that's locked with a key, so I might need to... Well, that might be actually just a way out. It's possible it could be a way out from this area once it's all sorted out because we're going to be opening a whole new area up. But we'll have to see. Okay, well, firstly, what's your name? Hello, my dear, how are you doing? Okay, I've got the machine from Rudy. You wanted to have a look. Indeed, let me see. A clever contraption. It appears that local algae have found a way to efficiently break industrial waste into micro-elements. It just pumps and pressurises the gas towards them. And makes a funny bull bull sounds. Finally, a logical explanation. <laughs> I told you, there's nothing like bulbulation. <laughs> bulbulation. Anyway, while you were gone, I thought of a plan. We need a way to get the device to the toxic area, and walking off foot is out of the question. Great, I like trains. <laughs> okay. I have some crops for you. Ah, oh, thank you. They'll surely be a useful a source of useful data. I've added notes to them. Sorry, about them to your journal. Okay. Ah. Yes, it was Lily, that's right. Always nice chatting to you, Lily. Okay, so in my collectibles now, I should have like a few different crops. Lovely. I still need to put like tomatoes in there and things like that, but I don't want to take too many things in my inventory at once, so I'll probably pop up here a few times with different things. Well, luckily, because it's in my collectibles book, I can, I can just go into my sort of box of tricks and... Uh, take out anything I haven't already taken. So. Down the hill and then uh, up the other hill <laughs> to the mine carts. Oh, they like to make me run in this game, don't they? So yeah, up to the mine cart and we'll stick the bulbinator in it. Bulbulator, sorry. Bulbulator. Uh, in it, and then we'll see what happens. Probably going to be way less exciting than I think it's going to be. I'm expecting like a cutscene and the whole thing to smash. And no. this game does not have cutscenes, by the way. Just just in case you were getting excited about that. But if anything would have been ideal to have one, that would have been. While all this is happening, um, my onions are growing, so there's been one day passed already. I imagine it'll probably need like two days to pass, and then the onions will be ready, then I can make ratatouille, and then we can make uh, the cows. And then I still need to find or try and make apple pie. Right, so the bulbulator is in the minecart. Oh, there's a big red button. Let's push the big red button. Even clearer sky. Done. And then it went all bulbul. The bulbul later works, it's magic. Now it's time to share the good news with Lily. She'll most likely want to explore the area by herself. No, I'm going in there. The Great Snowy Railway. I also totes want to drive this car down the railway line. 
I don't want to have to walk. Why is it making me walk? How dare? <laughs> Grr. I'm allowed to send the boba later down there, but I'm not allowed to send myself. Rude. Okay, so. I guess we're walking back <laughs> to see Lily, but I'm still super excited. I'm looking out for radio towers as I'm going around the place. It's, I'm still not seeing one, so I'm not entirely sure what I'm looking for there. Um, so I'll either see it or I won't, and if I don't, then I guess I'll have to go proper looking for it. Maybe at the top of here somewhere. No, that's just the railway. I mean, this is, this is sort of a sensible place for it to have maybe been, but no. I'm seeing no radio towers. I said it was small though, so that might be why I'm not not seeing it and being uh, a little bit a little bit on the silly side. But you know, as I say, I'll probably like turn a corner and realise where it is at some point. So I'll have a look around up by the cows on top of the hill as well. But also, I could have a look at the top and see, like, um, if it's maybe in the area where Lily is. It's possible that it's up there too, so keep my eyes open. But there are still areas I haven't opened up, so it might be there too. But I've got a feeling it's probably, like, right by the robot. And I'm just being very silly. Oh, wow, look whole new area oh, sight right let's talk to Lily first and then we'll go and like have a look around and uh, seems like we've got some robots to kill down there too hello my dear how are you doing we have it the gas is gone you truly are the hero of this place I have some ideas what might have happened to the sheep bring me mushrooms and I'll give you the antidote in no time a thesis in mycology. Mushroom picking is super fun, but I wish the circumstances were more pleasant. As it stands, the sheep need my help. Now the gas is taken care of, collecting the samples shouldn't cause any issues. By the way, a red-headed man was passing by here. Do you know him? Yes, it's Rudy. Uh, Rudy, he just wants to, uh, just went there to make sure the bulbulator doesn't get lost. So you got it from him. Curious. I think we're done talking to Lily for now. I want to run on those railway tracks and it's not gonna let me. It's like blocked at both ends. So annoying. Enemies! We haven't had many enemies in this uh, in this area so far, so it's actually kind of kind of cool to see some. Yes, keeping my, my eyes out for mushrooms, radio towers. Cows, I guess. Well, at least the mushrooms are obvious. And more enemies as well. It's actually quite a big group of them there. the spitters. Ah. 
Well, the kind of slightly annoying thing about this area is that everything is frozen. I mean, you don't have any water sources. Hello, sheeple. Okay, so that's mushroom at number two. We still have quite a few quests to go though, don't we? 14 of 23, so we're about, like about halfway through. A menacing looking radio station at the top of a hill. What hill? <laughs> Sometimes the cheeky way is best. Pizza margarita, yes. Getting all the good recipes. Sometimes the cheeky way is the best way. Get all this junk. I don't know why all this junk would be down here unless something good was in it, right? I was correct there is a mushroom down here so that would have been a bit of a pain to find i've been looking around everywhere going where's that mushroom time and time again it's just showing to me in this game that uh tidying really does pay off every single time how many have i gotten now is it three yes It would be nice if they turned all the individual piles of stuff in the Lonely Hills into like into these big piles that, of, of trash that they've got here. I think that's so much easier to deal with. But it, maybe maybe you have to sort of do your time. Like if you can if you can do your time with those, then you're allowed to have these easier to deal with ones. Only once you've proven yourself in combat. Because uh, the, the final mush, there's one more mushroom I need to get. The final one will probably be hidden in some trash somewhere. Also, it makes it look a lot nicer if there's no trash. It's such a pretty area, this one. It doesn't deserve to be covered in trash. trash over there. Yeah, call it, I'm calling it trash. I mean, that's very American of me, isn't it? Like, uh, generally, we would call it rubbish in the UK. Or not speak of it at all. Okay, so what have we got there? A no place like home picture. Decoration. I'll have to put that on my house and see what the what it's all about. Okay, we've got two more robots. So I have no water left, so I'm gonna. I will have to manually kill those guys. Everything is frozen. I could probably do it though, rather than put you guys through me having to. And do you know what? Do you know what? I'm so stupid. I literally have a well. For that precise reason. I'm waiting for the comments now. I was wondering when she'd remember the well. <laughs> I 
I remembered it before it was needed, and that is the main thing. Yeah, super useful in this area, though, because everything is frozen, so... Having some way of replenishing your water is actually super useful. I would say it's probably more useful than uh, having the well on the farm at this point, because for me, I've got all the sprinklers. I don't need well a well on the farm. I do need one when I'm out and about. Out and about. There we are, final mushroom. Eggplant casserole recipe. We must nearly have all the recipes now, and yet somehow, some some way, somehow, I've not managed to find. Hmm. I wonder what that's about. But in this game, it always pays to press a random button. Probably not a life lesson you should be taking away, but you know, it seems to pay in the game. around the place so what is that connected to I have no idea I usually find out at some point though I usually come across a door or something and it's like aha that's what it was all about there's a snowball Big pile of snowballs. I make some snowmen with that if I want to do. I haven't made any snowmen yet. There's probably an achievement for it. <laughs> I made the sheep jump. I think I did anyway. It's funny regardless. Okay, so I think that's all of the junk. Oh, no, I missed one. Okay. It's nearly all the junk here done. Where do I go from here, though? That definitely seems to be more to this area. I mean... have everything I need. Let's go back to Lily and hand in the quest. But there's definitely more quests to do. But I mustn't get ahead of myself. It might be that I'll be able to use the railway eventually. But I might need to do, like, enough quests to get to that. Because it looks very purposely blocked off there, doesn't it? And look, that minecart there has a big red button on the side. It's clearly for transporting me over there, right? Right? Okay. Lily, let's cure these sheep. Ellen, my dear, how are you doing? Great, I have the mushrooms for you. Fantastic, I'll take them for analysis at once. Right, got it. I have all the materials for herbal remedies except for some fenugreek. Bring me five of these and I'll provide as much of, as the sheep will need. Look for them in the swamp. Okay, so my next goal is collecting fenugreek, a herb required for a sheep cure. Those plants are growing in the swamp and Lily gave me a key to the gate that leads there. Shouldn't be a problem. Right. By the way, if you want to go there, I looked around in the old factory and found this key. It should you allow you to pass the gate to the, to the radio station and the swamp. There we go. I went there to check some things and it appears toxic sewage is leaking there. Could you please get some filters and cover any toxic pipes? The swamp would really benefit from this. So we need three water filters. Okay, lovely. Okay. Brilliant. So we've unlocked a whole bunch of new quests. Got eight to go still. 
And we've got one, two, three, four, five, six of them. I think it's 15 of uh, 15 of 23 are done. So yeah, we need to go to the swamp next episode, so that's pretty awesome. Alright. So I think what I'm going to do, my friends, is... Uh, now we've done this little bit and we need to go to the swamp, I am going to let you go here and I'm going to run back to my house. And I will see you next episode uh, in my house. And I will hopefully at that point have some onions. If not, we'll just sleep the night until we do get some onions. I'll make the ratatouille. And I'll try and make... I'll see if I can maybe try and work out the, the recipe for apple pie. Because it's probably something like... Apple and flour. So I'll try like sticking some apples and flour into the um, oven and see if I can make it. And if not, then we'll have to wait for the recipe because... Seriously, I don't have many recipes left to get right now. I've only got seven more. One of them will be apple pie. I don't know, a couple of other different ones. I don't know what I'll pick up, but uh, apple pie is one of the ones I need. And, and I think there's another one that I need and I've forgotten. I've forgotten what it was. Meh. So we might have to go and see Jay. But anyway. I'm going to leave you there. So that's it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more No Place Like Home, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.